so here we go for Wednesday. <clears throat> Which is the complete sentence? So as we know, we're looking for a complete thought. Brought his lunch today. Who brought his lunch? It doesn't tell us. Jason is my friend. Oh, that's a complete thought for sure. Okay. Circle the meaning. We travel to another class sometimes. Does that mean stop, move, or stay? Well, if our class is going to another class, that means we're moving. So we're going to circle. We move to another class sometimes. And that's something else you can do is put your word that you found in the sentence and see if it makes sense. We move to another classroom sometimes. Many people live in the village. So many, we know many is a lot. So a lot of people live in the alley. A lot of people live in the playground or a lot of people live in the town. Town for sure. Edit the sentence. Second grade is awesome. Yes, it is. We're going to start our sentence with a capital letter and second is spelled correctly. Let's look at grade. This actually says grad. Okay. We need that sneaky A. Remember when we have sneaky A's? This or the sneaky E, I apologize. This E actually doesn't have a sound, but it bosses this one and makes that say it's long sound, grade, okay? So second grade is awesome. And this is one of those sentences that with punctuation, I'm not going to put a period. I'm going to put an exclamation because, yes, second grade is awesome. Okay. Let's look at our compound words. Footprint. We're going to put those together. Footprint. Flagpole. We're going to put those together. Make one word. Okay. Circle the word that means ruin. Oh my goodness, that's a big word, ruin. Okay, so ruin, let's look at our words. Demolish, build, wreck, destroy, or tear down. We're gonna circle all of these words but one, okay? So ruin means to demolish. It can also mean to wreck. It could also mean to tear down, and it could also mean to destroy. So this week, what we've been working on here is synonyms. Those are words that mean the same as another word, okay? Build, that's the opposite. That would be an antonym. 